We're just here in the lab here at Bicor, um, where they mix and test the, the nutrients. Um, what I'm going to show you now is, is a compatibility test on, uh, on what a chelate actually really does to help protect the nutrient from falling out um, so it's better util utilized by the plant and the uptake and the translocations there. Um, let's do a little uh, scientific experiment here. What we have is just some plain uh, tap water. We have an iron. It's a, it's a lignol sulfonate. Um, this lignol sulfonate, it comes from the same family as a humic and fulvic acid. Um, it's a great carbon source for the soil, but as, as I will show you that um, for a chelating agent, what happens. Um, we've just got some regular 10340, uh, a phosphorus product, and then we have uh, the bicore iron. So what I'm going to do is that we'll fill these these tubes up with some water. Uh, next we have our uh, our 1034, a phosphorus product. So um, just to let everybody know what a what a chelate actually does. Um, when you're mixing micronutrients like your iron, zinc, copper, manganese, boron, etc. in with, uh, with nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, um, it's, it's real important to have your micronutrients chelated. And what a chelate actually is, it's, it's a, it's, we'll say it's like a shield that's going to protect it um, from phosphorus and, and pH differences. Um, it, it, this is very important as, as I will show you what happens if, 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 your, if, if your nutrients aren't chelated correctly. Now see how this iron, hope all you can see that. But see how it, 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 it is tied up. And a plant's going to have a, a pretty hard time of, of pulling iron out of that. So when you're putting iron down, it, it, ha it does have to be in a form for the plant to uptake it. And even if, even if you're not putting any nitrogen or phos phosphorus down, you're just putting, a, say, just an iron in the individual in itself, um, there, there's free phosphates on the soil and on the leaves, so that's what will happen. Um, now we have our, our iron. That's the 5% chelated iron. And as you can see, the clarity, and that's, and that's with all our products. Um, that's why they're so efficient and beneficial for the plant, because all the nutrients are in a true solution. So the plant can uptake it in the translocation there. Uh, another nice thing with these um, organic and amino acids is that the plant, they're, they're biodegradable, so the, the plant and the and the soil micro microbial life can use them as an energy source, so there's no harmful residues left in the plant or the soil.